Hello and welcome to this video tutorial. In this video, we'll show how to search for and retrieve guest records in Cloud PM. I'll start at the reservations home page. Although this video is focused on finding reservation records, the tips you'll see here also work when searching for records in other modules of Cloud PM, such as groups, profiles, city ledger, even housekeeping. On the top left side of the screen, Notice the headings listed under the Reservations module for New, Find, and View. Under the heading labeled Find, we'll click on the link for Reservation, which brings us to the search screen. On the search screen, there are a number of options to search for a guest. We can search by confirmation number if that's available, or we can search by last name, first name, a specific arrival or departure date, or any combination of these. The system also has a number of preset options to quickly retrieve a guest list. As you can see from the drop-down, we have several to choose from. If we click on Search without entering any criteria, Cloud PM attempts to return every guest and will give us a message that we need to narrow things down a little. Because we are communicating over the Internet, we need to limit the amount of data that we're calling for at any one time, so I'll click OK, insert a last name, then search again. The search has returned all records with the last name Baker, regardless of their status. Let's look at another search feature where the system can find a record based on just a few characters, whether those characters are at the beginning, in the middle, or at the end. By entering the percent symbol and the letters TH in the last name field, the system returns records that start with TH, such as Thompson, and also guests where TH is anywhere in the last name, such as Matthew. This is very helpful when you're uncertain of the exact spelling of a name, but you know at least a portion. Another feature is the green magnifying glass here on the left. By clicking on the magnifying glass, we can go directly to the part of the guest record that we want to access. For example, clicking on Rates and Taxes goes directly to the Rates form, bypassing the guest information portion of the record. We also have the option of simply clicking on the guest's name or the confirmation number, which is a link. This will take me to the reservation. Likewise, clicking the folio number will go directly to the folio. Last but not least, we'll take a look at the grouping feature. By moving a column header to the grouping bar, The guest records will be ordered together based on these criteria. If you want to restore your previous sort order, the grouping box can easily be dragged back to its original location. Thank you for taking the time to view this video. Please feel free to contact your account manager or our customer support center for additional questions.